First, we're gonna lock him into a four-year deal. Now he's on the Hornets with his brother. If I win the challenge on the challenge wheel, I get one spin of the Miracle Wheel to help save his career. Let's make Ball a superstar. But for this first year, we're gonna give him a free spin. And he's gonna go ahead and get plus three to all playmaking attributes. Well, he went up two overalls, but at least he's almost in the rotation. Same old, same old. At least one of the balls made an NBA team. And the Hornets are poverty. I guess playing one minute is better than nothing. I'm not gonna lie, I take that back. I think I'd rather not play at all than play one minute the entire season. For the comments in my last video, yes, I am well aware now he is in Taiwan, not China. Thank you. All right, let's see what our first challenge is. And it's gonna go ahead and be roll a die. Can't get more random than that. I'm gonna trust the Google gods here and go with an even number. Let's go ahead and roll it. And we got, of course, it's an odd number. I don't know what's crazier, LiAngelo starting or Bridges being here. Luca going back to back. Lamelo's on second team. Not like that really matters to this video. And the Hornets are poverty once again. Jello had a pretty good year. 14, 5, and 5. That's not bad. I mean, almost shooting better from three than the field is kind of crazy. So we, we, we gotta work on that. Bro's putting up Jason Tatum numbers in the finals. But now I gotta win a challenge. We need the wheel to start doing some stuff. And we're gonna go ahead and get golf with your friends. I've been pretty good at this. I just gotta hit it very softly. Hopefully that... Oh my god. Okay, that might have been the worst hit I could have done. Let me go like right... Actually, I'd go like right here. Is this how hills work? Oh, I just missed it. I was I was on the right track with it. Yeah, I'm not proud of that. And that right there is why we make Langelo get better by himself as well. Because I'm clearly a liability. Just a casual 37 and 10 from Ja. And the Hornets are finally not poverty. Langelo dropping 16, 5, and 6. Not bad at all, man. I don't know if this is a good thing or bad thing. He's still shooting better from 3 than the field. But I think we'll live with him shooting 47%. We got a close one here up 3-2. We got Jellicar and RJ. RJ gonna use the screen. He's gonna drop that. Okay, just layup lines. I don't know what Bridges was doing there. Let's see that cheat. Chino Hills chemistry or Lamelo's just gonna jack and just take a contested layup. That's a great shot, man. We got the Soma shooting a second free throw here to make it a two possession game. He misses it. Oh, rebound Hornets. Here's a great coaching strategy from the Hornets. They need a three and they take out their best three point shooter. Oh, nice shot, Melo. Oh, that's this is great offense. Let's see if they bounce back game seven. Well, at least they still won on to the second round. Oh, Lamelo with just a casual 59 and 10. They started Brandon Miller over Leangelo, and that's exactly what they get. That's gonna be a sweep. I mean, Leangelo didn't play that good shooting 35 from three, but still, don't do that to him. We're trying to save his career, not kill his confidence. Looks like Jello's a fringe all-star now, but we gotta make him a superstar. Come on, Wheel, help me out. The next challenge is gonna be open a my team pack. Great, gotta spend money. Our goal is to at least pull a diamond out of these season one super packs. Well, here we go. Show me potato salad, and we got ourselves an amethyst, meaning we went three in a row without even spinning the miracle wheel. Man, you'd think a video about spinning a wheel would actually involve spinning a wheel, but I guess not. Jaw going back to back, and we're fighting in the playing tournament, and we won the first game, so we're in. Jello dropping 17, 6, and 7. And this team was already OP in the sim. Now they just have Giannis. Well, we somehow won two games. I'll take it. The top one's Leangelo here. He had 29 and 10 and made five threes. Good game from him. And the Thunder won the championship. How did they beat this Cavs team? And Jello decided to take his talents elsewhere. Hopefully. I don't know if he's on a team or not. And he decided to team up with Zion on the Pelicans. Can I just get an easy challenge? Like, I just I just want to spin the Miracle Wheel just like one time. That'd be really cool. Roll a die again. Woo! I love odds. We're going to go odd this time. What do we got? Please be an odd number. I just, I, I, I can't get a break. Without the enhanced progression I gave Lanzo, he would be out of the league by now. <laughs> this is crazy. Luca coming back with pedestrian numbers, and we just got in the playoffs as the sixth seed. I thought he put up more than 18 a game, but I guess he doesn't have tendencies or anything like that, which would help if I could win one of these challenges. But I guess we'll never know. We got the Rockets in the first round. Yeah, I don't think Lanzo and Zion's a great duo. I don't, I don't know if this is a good idea. I mean, you can't get much better than this, shooting 53% from three in the playoffs. That is insane. And here comes the legacy. Oh, I, I'm surprised it wasn't Josh Giddy. All right, Shay. I imagine a world where we don't even get one spin of the miracle wheel and it's starting to look way more realistic as we keep doing this we got minecraft all right we got a 2v2 fight yo where's my guy are, are you hiding like what, what are we gonna do with that why are you teabagging the we gotta go fight are we gonna fight like wh like what is this we're just communicating we're just talk. i just i just want to talk all right well we killed them both that was really stupid well i don't feel good about that win but i'll take it let's see what we got here on the miracle wheel please be something good all the okay that helps a lot and leangelo is officially a 99 overall still got more to work on but you know we're, we're getting there Giannis still in Cleveland. And Leangelo finally made an NBA team. And he's got the Pelicans as the fourth seed. How did Leangelo not lead his team in scoring? Justin Edwards averaged more than you. We got Memphis in the first round. And they're gonna lose to Memphis in seven. I mean, Jello did his thing. 25, 9, and 10. Almost a triple-double in the playoffs. But I guess he's gonna have to play better Pacers when the chance... Oh, Bronny's getting rings now. Well, here we go. Next challenge. We need Jello to drop like 30. Oh, not again. Please, not again. Oh, my God. I got beef with this hole. We're running it back. Maybe if I try going off it. Like, if, if, if I don't get... The Bro, I... I, I, I 
I, I don't know why I went back to this hole. Well, up here we go. I got another show. Oh, 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 I actually aimed it correctly. We need something to where he can win MVP. So bless us with something good from the Miracle Well. Oh, sh okay, that helps out. All right, well, not really. His mid-range is three. We're already at 99. So I guess he gets a nice post fade. Let's see if that makes him MVP. Oh, so Leangelo can't win MVP, but Bronny does. Well, he's getting closer. At least he got first team. And the Pelicans are semi-relevant. Did Leangelo make a call to go get Lonzo or something? How do we have Lonzo? They signed him to a minimum contract deal. How do you even finesse that hard? Well, let's see what happens in the first round versus Xavier Booker. And they're going to blow us out here in game seven. I think Jello might be a playoff choker, bro. These are bad numbers for him. And the Thunder win the championship. Oh, now, they, like, any Thunder player can just win finals MVP. Looks like Leangelo's team hopping. Did Bull Bull convince you to come to this sorry Bucks team? All right, well, what's our next challenge? Give me something easy and not Monopoly. Okay, great. All right, first piece around the board wins. What's my first number going to be? A nine. Good start. Can you stay below a nine and you're going to get a... Okay, you're going to get a seven. Please don't be a cheesy chance card. Don't be something crazy. Advance the Charles. Okay, well, he's going to get ahead of me. Come on, what do we got now? A six. That felt kind of cheesy, but I'll take a nine again. Roll like a solid four or something like that. He got a six. How did he get another card? Like, this is actually cheesy. Oh, there we go. Well, if I don't win this now, then I'm just trash. What do we got here? A Is that a seven? We got a seven. He got a seven again. He's going to get another chance card or chest, whatever the hell it's called. He's going to get... Oh, yo, that's great. That's great. That is, that is amazing. But thank you, Monopoly. That's awesome. I'm getting my back blown out by these challenges. Scoot got an MVP. Jello's still on first team. And the Bucks are poverty. Just missed the playoffs. Hey, at least Leangelo is stat padded. A nice 30, 10, and 7 year. Easily his best season. If he was just like the 6C with those numbers, he probably would have won MVP. It's been a sad day for the Miracle Wheel. And what do we got here? Uh, dude, I, I just... This this is ridiculous. Let's just go even. What do we what do we got to lose? Hey, we actually won it. I'm very sorry to the people who want to see more Miracle Wheel spins. But it's the rule of the game. That's how it works. It is what it is. Okay. So adding plus 8 to his height is going to make him 7 foot 1. If he can't win MVP like this, then I don't know what else we can do. How did he not win MVP? Well, he got the bucks at a 6 seed. How do you have worse numbers than last year in your 7 1? Ooh, we got a ball. Bro oh, of course he has Weapon Yama, the final boss. And we're going to get a gentleman sweep here. Very surprising. Now we got to play the Hornets. And wait, Ingram. Oh, I didn't even realize Ingram's not even on this team anymore. <laughs> we got a tie game here in game 7. Ingram going to use the screen here. Jello trying to guard him. Stay in front of him. That's a gr oh, I don't even know why Ingram went up with that. Okay, what is the play call here? We're going to go to Blackburn in the clutch. Oh, we're going to give the Joe in the clutch. Four seconds. Dives into Lewis. What a pass. Five seconds left here. Just got to get a stop on B.I. Don't let him at the basket. Good defense, Leangelo. And they are going to the conference finals. Leangelo with a triple double here in game seven. And Bailey dropped 33. We got the Celtics in the conference finals. They got Bencaro. And we were able to take it to seven games. But they're going to blow us out here. I don't know how we stop Lamelo and Victor Webb and Yama Belusa this team. But okay. What do we got next here? And it's good. There's no, there's no way I've landed on roll a die this many times. Let's go odd this time. What do we got? It's going to be a one. Well, at least I'm getting it right. I would like to do more challenges, though, than just rolling a die. Can we be a little more interesting? Unlock all playmaking badges. Here's every single playmaking badge on Hall of Fame. Let's try to win that championship. Here's one of five Thunder players to win MVP. And the Bucks go from conference finals to irrelevant. And there's Jello with a stat padding season. And Jello left again. He's just collecting jerseys at this point. How did you somehow join a team that was worse than that Bucks team? This is bad. Well, we're gonna have to make him a demigod. I mean, he pretty much already is, but you get the point. Score a touchdown in Madden. Okay. All right, well, this looks like cover two. So let's hope McKissick can get open on this. Please don't. Oh, oh, there's Nick Bosa just out of nowhere. I'm gonna try this play again. Let's see if Nick Bosa comes off that line. He does it. I'm gonna hit Logan Thomas. Please catch it. You're a bum. All right, well, here's our last chance. I'm, I'm throwing that. Oh, what? Oh, yeah. Yeah, Fred Warner can just jump 10 feet in the air. VJ Miller win an MVP. And Jello somehow made this team good while averaging 22, 9, and 10. I mean, they're not bad numbers, but he's had way better seasons. We got Memphis in the first round with Cole Anthony. And they're going to beat us in six. I'm starting to get nervous. I don't know if he'll ever get that ring. Here's the fourth Thunder player to win a finals MVP. All right, I promise I won't lose this next challenge no matter what. Even if it's random, the gods will be on my... Not roll die again. Okay, all right, we'll do Minecraft. We're going to do parkour this time. It's a 1v1. I did a Minecraft rebuild, so I know this like the back of my hand. Well, I know I'm on a good pace. I don't know. I can't say the same for the other guy. All right, well, I'm about to be at the end, and I don't see this guy anywhere. So I think I'll just go ahead and walk right to my victory. Let's see if we can find him on the map here. Uh, oh yeah, there is nowhere in sight. I don't know how much better we can make Leangelo. Maybe some height or defense or some badges or, I don't know, or just get every badge in the game. You can see them right here, all of them on Hall of Fame. How did this team get worse? We have, to, <laughs> like, I love Tyler, but like a seven overall Tyler is crazy. There's the final boss getting an MVP. Wow, okay, Leangelo averaging a 
triple double and winning defensive player of the year but sadly we're in the playing tournament and we won so we're in now we got a first round matchup versus chat and they're just gonna gentlemen sweep us this has been so much fun one of the ball brothers retired the chances of making him better are so low but okay let's just keep going and we're gonna get fall guys gonna jinx myself here off to a pretty great start oh, can one of these come down can, can these come oh yeah that's a oh that's awesome yeah i'm cooked there's no way i place top 10 i'd have to literally just be incredibly lucky to get top 10 all right yeah, yeah all right we can go ahead and cook this one let's see if langelo can carry douglas manning ronnie got another mvp and the wolves are back in somewhat contention jello having a solid year putting up 24 10 and 9 let's see if he can take down whitmore and holland looks like definitely not that's gonna be a sweep this man has yet to stay with one team just to join a mid bowls team we're not even gonna spin the wheel anymore he literally can't get any better there's nothing else we can add so let's just see what happens can jello just get one mvp why is jello just so bad at winning well they won the first game and we lost the second no playoffs he shot six for 20 bro jello is so bad in the playoffs he's not even averaging the most points on his own team how did he leave again oh now you want to be in charlie you didn't want to be there with lamello as a high 90 but now you want to be here with a uh, brian carpenter another mvp for brawny this man is the 10th seed won the first game again and loses the second one again oh look at that he lost to lamello if this man leaves one more team he wants his farewell tour in the garden i guess scoot with an mvp i'm done with this loser bro i'm sorry leangelo not you in real life bro just your in-game guy's a loser you just got dropped off by the team you left like how does this feel thank god he retired i had enough of this i mean he put up good numbers in his career 23 and 9 like that's fine he was first team all nba nine times all defense nine times defensive player of the year twice he just never did anything else and he did make the hall of fame he's 34th in points all time 15th in threes 50th in rebounds 32nd in assists right next to lonzo 90th in block 66 in steals and 66 in turnovers well leangelo i guess we saved your career but at the same time we did i hope all goes well for you in real life goodbye